No, 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 no. The following series you're about to watch has some characters owned by other creators. All credits are to those users, since our inmate doesn't own them. I guess Paloma sent me a new video. I wonder if she found something funny or interesting. I understand that he's a jock, but it's been so long that I never wanted to return his calls. I'm still a bad person, and I don't want to be friends with him again. It's been a while, man. What's wrong with you? Why are you doing this? Look. I know it's been a long time, but you need to forgive me. We can move on from what happened years ago. I don't forgive you. Not one bit. What? You would get mad at me for no reason when I would hang out with Bryson, and not with you. You literally broke us apart in the first place. I'm trying to warn you. Well you should be more aware of the consequences. If I don't act the way Bryson tells me to, then I'm off the team for good. I'm just trying to fix our relationship. It doesn't have anything to do with sports at all or Bryson. Well, whatever you're trying to do, you're only doing it for yourself, not for me. I. I. I'm not. Well, why did you post this? I understand that he's a jock, but it's been so long that I never wanted to return his calls. I'm still a bad person, and I don't want to be friends with him again. I didn't say anything like this. Of course you did. Paloma is right. Well, don't believe her. She's lying. Why would she lie? I believe everything she posts. You're just being a drama king like you usually are. I was just trying to make amends, but it seems to me that things are getting worse. Ugh. This isn't good. Alrighty. Here's your order. Hold on, where is your friend? He just left. I'll pay for the food. Alrighty. Enjoy. He ordered my favorite. <laughs> oh my gosh, Pally, you're so hilarious. Yeah, you're the best. Thanks girls. Now, let's go find someone else to mess with. Not her, not him, he's pretty chill. Oh, how about her? Janice Moore? I don't know her at all. Oh come on Paloma, it's the new girl. Yeah, but we have to wait. Why? Don't we want to pick on her because she's not like us? There is no point in targeting her immediately, we got to let her settle in first. But she's different than us. Plus, she looks like that other girl you harass. I want to wait to see if they become friends first. If they do, then we'll begin making a scheme. Oh come on Pally, like that's gonna happen. It will happen. I know it will. Meet me and Penelope on Monday and we will settle this. Oh yeah. We're wombats. Wombats. We're not afraid at all. We'll win the game and face the foes and we'll never fall. Wombats, wombats, we're going to rule, and even though we might not win, we will be cool. Oh my gosh, are you this dumb? That is literally not our cheer. You're our cheer captain, you're supposed to teach the cheers to the freshmen. Look girls, I know those cheers too, I just wanted to try a new one. New cheers aren't required in this club. Relax Sonia, I'm teaching the school's cheers as well. Well, only teach them poor ass, not one of your stupid teen movie routines. Okay. I can do that. Hold on. 
Who's Paula again? Uck. How can you be our captain, when you don't even know who Paula is? I don't know. Maybe because I was the only kid who was new to this team, and volunteered to be the captain, because the principal is too lazy to hire a cheer coach. Let's just go. Hopefully, these actions will stop. Did they really have to pick her? She doesn't fit the role at all. Um. I mean. She doesn't seem to have any skills that fit the role. Where were you last night? You weren't here for practice. Oh, um. I wasn't feeling well. I see. Anyway, are you going to Bryson's party on Saturday? I'll be there. Right boys, rest up this weekend. Our first game is Monday. Hey, you're pretty good. Oh, thanks. I'm the new cheer captain. You're the captain? I've never seen you around before. Oh, I'm from Drowan, Iowa, and I was a cheerleader on the Flames. This is my first year in Victopolis. Wow. So you do have experience. I sure do. Oh, by the way, my name is Janice Moore. Pete Roth. Wombat's wide receiver. I can't wait to work with this team this season. I've heard that. Roth. Are you coming? Sorry, my coach is calling me. Oh, no worries. We can chat sometime soon. I'm coming, sir. Where were you? I had to tie my shoe. You're wearing slip-ons, Roth. Hold on, did I say shoe? I meant to say stumble. I accidentally stumbled on the grass and twisted my ankle. Oh gosh, do I need to pull you out of the starting roster? No, I can play. I just got to be careful. Okay then. Just remember Roth, the team is hopeless without you. If you say so. Paloma tricked him. She lied about me, and he wouldn't believe me when I told him. That's harsh, bro. So are you going to try again? I'm not sure. If we keep on bringing it up, Paloma might spy on us more and more. Stop. Please. Hello, little girl. You want a hug and chocolate chip cookies? I'm the same maid as you. I truly am. Well, do you know Paloma Dorsey? No. I don't. Uck. Whatever. You just made things less exciting. Hey, are you alright? I'm fine. I just can't believe that girl threw me. Well, she's a bully after all. Bullies go after easy targets. Why? Are you one of those bullies as well? I'm the complete opposite. I'm happy you're okay though. Thanks for checking on me. My name is Emily Rory. Janice Moore. The new cheer captain of Eastbury. Nice to meet you. Oh my gosh, I'm meeting so many people already. Have you met Pete Roth yet? Oh that sweet ginger with the beautiful freckles? Yeah I met him. He is going to be the main linebacker for the first game of the season. You got to see the football game tonight. It's gonna be so much fun. I'll go to this. Foot. Ball. Event. I'll bring my friends as well. Awesome. What class do you have next? History, with Mr. Mahan. Yo, I have him as well. Wanna walk together? Why not? You think she's safe with her? She seems decent. Hopefully her niceness isn't fake. Now they're walking close together. Are they skipping now? They are definitely skipping now. Damn, I wish I had someone to skip with me. In the early 1930s, Japan invaded Manchuria, which resulted in the Japanese gaining power to become one of the strongest nations in the 1930s. Make sure you have all this down, we'll have a test next week about this subject. Anyway, we moved back to Germany and... Did you tell the sophomores about the plan? You bet I did. Perfect. Now it's time to get to work. Hey new girl, you're performing tonight, right? Yeah. I'm going to perform before the game and during halftime with my girls. Well, I heard that you were friends with that Emily Rory girl, right? How do you know her? Oh, we go way back. We used to be on the same youth volleyball team. Cool. But to get back on topic, I actually want to help you. I talked to your cheerleading group over the weekend, 
and your group decided to do another routine that I helped organized, it's called the sort year. I have a copy of the script so you can memorize it. I can memorize this, perfect. You be the rock star you are, and show those people that you're gonna be a great cheer captain. Also, I'll give you a huge reward at the end. I'll do anything for a reward. I hope it's one of those slushies from the convenience store. Oh, I promise I'll get you one. Alrighty students, remember that the essay is due Thursday, so please work on it when you can. Have a good day. I tell you Emily, when tonight hits, you're gonna have a great time. Well I really hope you do a good job. I'm bringing two of my buddies as well. So you'll see me in the bleachers. Oh my gosh I'm so excited. It's nice that we got front row seats for this game. Look, we were just lucky, the security guards literally just asked the Tittenville boys to move. Who cares? I'm excited to see Janice perform. Same here. I'm also excited to see Pete in action as well. Just tell me when the game's over. Are you sure this is worth doing? Oh come on Janice, you're the head. This was a rejected cheer we had a month ago, but we're finally using it. Think of it as a golden ticket. You really want to use a golden ticket, don't you? That was a great first quarter. Our Eastbury Wombats are destroying the Titanville Comets. Pete Roth just made his first touchdown this season. Hopefully he can keep his streak alive. But anyway, before we continue into the next quarter, we have to introduce our number one fans of the team. Please, welcome the Eastbury Wombats cheerleaders. Oh yeah, this is going to be great. Come on Janice, you can do it. Oh yeah. We are wombats, wombats, we're not gonna fight we will lose the game and yell in pain and cry in the night. Wombats, wombats, we're going to lose the players suck, we're out of here, and we're going to sneeze. You yes, really deserve real. comets to win, you're so bad at this. What the heck was that? That doesn't sound like something she would say. You guys horrible, I'm done with that stupid team. I'm never gonna do something like this ever again. Look at that little baby crying off in the distance. Isn't that incredibly funny? I got to fix this. Hold up kid, you're not doing this alone. I'm coming as well. Hey, where are you going Roth? You know, remember the injury I had last week? Yeah. I think I need some ice. I can't lose you, kid. You're the star player. Oh gosh, the pain is actually getting worse. You need to go on without me. Fine. Aura, you're in. You got it, sir. I won't let you down. Wait. Wait. How did How you, did get, you here get here so, so fast? fast? Shouldn't you be playing in the game, Pete? Well, we were concerned about what just happened. Seems like your diss track made the fans upset. I didn't meant it on a personal level. I even looked at it before, it seemed kind of sketchy. Well, it didn't sound nice. Whatever you wrote was very off-key. I never wrote that. Paloma did, and she told me to perform it. I really wanted that reward, but I guess it wasn't worth it in the end. Well, I think you should double-check what she wrote next time. If it's something bad, then you probably don't want to use it. Emily's right. You need to be careful, kid. Oh, hey Paula. Oh, hi Roth's kid. Aren't you supposed to be playing? I came here to check on our new cheer captain for the season. I see. So this is the new captain, right? Yup. Do what you gotta do. I see. Is everything alright? I'm a little better. I just don't feel like going out there. I'm not as amazing as you are. You don't have to be perfect, kid. I was in a similar position like you were. I was not praised by my peers back when I was a senior. Not many people liked me, 
no one really socialized with me and they also thought I was incredibly weird. But you know who was there to help me? My family. My family was always there to support me, and they told me to never give up. So I started having a little more confidence and people started to like me a little more. It might be slow at the start, but some people will probably notice. I'm not really looking into popularity though. I just want to have fun and not be bossed around for not doing any of your cheers. Cheers. I never had any special cheers. I guess someone just looked back at me and thought I was the best of the group, so they just plastered my name on their playbook. So the cheers were a lie? Yup. I dealt with those girls before anyone. Just ignore them and do what you have to do. Just don't be afraid to be yourself. But what if they judge me again? Who cares? Just have a fun time out there and think about the people who actually support you. You know what? I'll give it another shot. It's never too late to do anything. That's my girl. Well, she's actually really great at advice. Well, that's what Paula tries to do, and people always forget that about her. Yo Emily, has everything been resolved? Yup, everything is all set. Janice is ready to go back out. Good. We just walked for a little bit during the game, and I got a soda. Yeah, I just went to my Godspell playlist during the walk. Listen, if I hear day by day one more time, then I'll literally scream. Come on Ken, let's go back to the game. That boy over there, do you know him? Yeah, I wish we were on better terms. I think you will. The game's not over yet. That was the second touchdown scored by Nashora. The Wombats lead in the second quarter by 21 points. Now let's go back to the field and watch some more cheerleading. Please welcome back the Wombat Oh, this is going to be so funny to watch. I can't wait to hear her say the thing again. Oh yeah, we're Wombats, Wombats, we're not afraid at all. We'll win the game and face the foes, and we'll never fall. Wombats, wombats, we're going to rule and even though we might not win, we will totally be cool. Let's get out of here girls. She wasted our time. Oh my gosh, she did great. She pulled it off. That was incredible. We really pulled it off well. Not gonna lie. I really like this kid. Why do I have to deal with these idiots? Why did we leave the game early? I really wanted to see the end of it. Vivian, did you forget that we had a plan? Melinda literally told you about it when we were in her car. Oh, sorry Pally. Well, we failed the mission anyway. Well, they didn't technically win. You won the first round. Yes, but we still failed. I now have that stupid clip of her doing her off-key social media choreography. So what are we going to do next? Wait until someone else comes in to support them? We can still harass them, but we need to stop them from trying to ruin our plans. But why do we pick on Emily and Janice? We usually pick on other girls in our grade who can't even fit into the eSpory system. They've already made me a problem, and this is the only way I can solve it. 